So today with me I have the Samsung Galaxy Tab S7 and it's running the latest uh, Evolution X Android 15 and today I'm going to show you how to install it. So I have already installed the recovery and unlocked the bootloader in my previous video of installing One UI 6.1.1. So I'm going to head straight to the recovery. So to head to the recovery first I'm going to turn off the tablet. So I'm going to hit power off and now the tablet is off I can press and hold the volume up and uh, power button until the tablet turns on and now I can press once to uh, agree to that and it should go into the recovery now if you want to find out how to do it from stock you can check on my other video so now it is inside the recovery asking me if I want to connect I want to connect and now let's head over to the computer so on the computer I should go to my file explorer and I should go into platform tools which you should have already done if you have gone to my previous video and then you should click on that search bar you should delete everything and then you should type cmd this will open a command prompt window where we can check if the device is connected or not by typing ADB devices and pressing enter and as you can see it's saying that it's already connected in recovery mode so let's go to on the tablet we can go to advanced First we need to wipe the data, so we need to wipe and then format it, but uh, if you're if you going from something else you should wipe and format it, I am not going to do that as I want to keep my data. And now, you sh after formatting the data, you should go to ADB sideload, you should click on wipe dial with cache and wipe standard cache, click on swipe to uh, start the adb side load and now the adb side load is started we can check if it's connected again by going on to my computer and then typing adb devices again and now you can see that it's in side load mode perfect so now we can type adb side load and then i'm going to go to my file explorer and then I'm going to drag and drop the evolution x file to install the evolution x and now we can hit enter as you can see on the computer it has started and on the tablet also it has started we do not really care about all these errors here this is because we don't have data encryption yet so now it's going to start installing and I'll cut to when it's done installing. So the ROM is now installed successfully. Uh, it's saying install took 401 seconds to complete. And on the computer, you can see that it's saying ADB failed to read command no error. Uh, this does not mean that the command has failed. This is just something ADB is saying. And you should not worry about it. Uh, and now we should just be able to reboot the system and it should reboot into evolution x so let's see i'll turn the tablet into landscape mode press the power button and let's see
and now we have it successfully booted into evolution x you should see the starting up screen uh, where you need to set it up but as i haven't uh, you know formatted my data i have the screen and that's pretty much it uh, i am i will unlock it and i will show you what all it can do so as you can see it's pretty smooth and everything feels snappy also all the ai features work nice like circle to search works perfectly fine it's a little laggy because i just rebooted it but yeah very cool and apps also work like pixel weather works great Yeah. and that's pretty much it uh that's it for today see you next time